to that, that I think Molly's absolutely right. I think there's a danger that people have had a brief look at what it's like to get some acknowledgement. And if that's taken away, um, that's going to have a more detrimental effect than before. And I think, but I think the key issue that Molly's away is trust, because I think driving particularly home care behaviour, the, the commissioning behaviours and the way that care is fought by local authorities and CCGs, often there's an underpinning lack of trust and partnership. And if a provider is made to feel there's a lack of trust and partnership, then that filters down to the workforce feeling there's a lack of trust and partnership. And I think the what we've seen is we've seen things like pay for minute by minute for home care. I mean, whoever thought that this critical role of compassion and care can be broken down into paying people by the minute and having people on their goodwill not be paid for when they're walking up someone's garden path waiting to get in the most vulnerable people because criteria levels are only such that we don't deliver to people who it's a nice to have as Mel said they need their visits so if you're not trusted that's what a pay by minute call does to you as a, as a team member it makes you feel that no one trusts you no one trusts you to make that judgment I think some of that has all been taken away during COVID because we've just gone on planned care our team members have been, uh, they've been left to trust by necessity. Um, so they've got on with it because they're very capable, they care, they're resilient, they're adaptable, they're hugely skilled, and they've got on with it. And I think if we go back to some of these commissioning practices like pay by minute, it's going to just completely demoralise our home care workforce and make them feel that, again, as Marlene says, oh, you, you were useful for that period, actually now we'll go back to pushing you on the sidelines not trusting you not trusting your judgment not trusting your timekeeping thinking that you and your provider are just out to kind of rip people off they're the fundamentals and and those commissioning behaviors and those purchasing behaviors drive how our workforce feel at the end of the day thank you thank you